dear sixth sem students welcome back into my another video hope you are all doing well these are the important questions of uh, subject design of steel structural elements it is combination of theoretical uh, portions and numerical portions but much more portion is numerical part problematic part so your focus should be on numericals okay design problems are there you have to use your handbook to solve the numericals okay so let me discuss here first the theoretical important questions which might be appear in the examination okay so first question i will take from model first <clears throat> what are the advantages and uh, disadvantages of steel structures distinguish between working stress design and limit state design of steel structures and determine the shape vector for a triangle of base width b and height h explain different types of loads and load combinations to be considered in the design of steel structures these are the four important theoretical questions so 10 10 marks it may, may be asked in the examination in the first part okay or in second part there will be some problems and this question may be in the second part okay and with the numerical 10 marks so first of all these two are super important questions which you should definitely go through okay so this is all about model first and as far as numericals are concerned go through the paper 18 7 61 okay so try to cover three papers and try to solve some numericals over there okay next is a model second explain the failure modes of bolted connection what are the advantages and disadvantages of a welded connection mention any four advantages and disadvantages of disadvantages of hsfg bolts okay next is list the type of welded joint with sketches what are the common defects in welding explain briefly with neat sketch and as far as numericals are concerned same paper you have to refer 18 civil 61 so as i earlier mentioned that numerical part is much more in the subject so your main focus should be on numericals next is model third explain the failure modes of axial loaded column mention design specifications for battening as per is 800 2007 explain the behavior of compression number uh, design numericals may be 20 marks question or sometimes 10 10 marks question so refer the papers and the model question paper so that you will practice varieties of numericals more you practice more you will understand the concept of this particular subject next is model 4 you have to cover theoretical portions like uh, what are lug angles and uh, explain briefly with a neat sketch explain the factors affecting strength of tension members super important question explain column splices and gussets and expand slave base and gusseted base with neat sketch and the numericals as usual design problems it may be 20 marks question in the or part 18 civil 61 and model question paper is enough to cover the varieties of numericals right now last model is model fifth briefly explain the factors affecting lateral stability of beams explain with neat sketch beam to beam connection bolted beam to uh, column connection bolted what is web buckling and uh, web crippling briefly explain different types of uh, scattered connections write a note on literally unsupported beam okay so you can go through only one chapter also where uh, there is design problems of 20 marks if you are convenient with the numerical part so better to go through 20 20 marks problems which are most important ones as far as previous year questions are concerned and moral question paper so my best wishes are with you dear friends uh, so try to clear the subject in the first attempt itself so make sure you will share this video to all your friends and batchmates so that they can cover these important questions as earlier as possible only one day is left for your examinations now thank you